Hello, my name is Anton Council and this is Roof Framing 101. And today we are going to learn how to cut a bay window roof. These roofs are one of the more complicated roofs. Many carpenters end up scratching their heads because they don't know how to figure the, uh, the rafter lengths. They don't know how long the hip should be, what angle they should run at. Uh, some people don't know that uh, you need four sets of hips rather than two. And they also have a hard time making the overhangs line up. So uh, today we are going to break it down and uh, learn how to break down the math and calculate all this so you can do it with ease. So as you can see here, we have a diagram for how to frame a bay window roof. And this is a, this is a picture or a diagram of a, of a relatively simple, normal bay window roof that you see all the time. And uh, we're going to devise how to come up with the different spans and angles. So as we see here, we've got span run B already dictated. And this is relatively easy to figure out because, as you can see, your valley starts from the inside corner of your bay. And so from corner to corner is how you would come up with your span for run B. But as we see here, we show span run A, main span run A. Now how would you come up with that? Where, where do you know when to tie these two hips in and how far back to do it? This is a problem that many people have. So an easy way to explain this would be the length of side for this length of wall right here, as you notice, is 76 inches. And that goes from here to this point here. And this is what helps you dictate everything. So. This is a picture, as you can see here, of a full octagon, a relatively large one, it, it, it seems. But uh, as you notice here, I've got the slice cut out for, uh, for this. So as you can see, we're going to make this based off of this length of side. It's just going to be one-eighth of the pie of a full octagon. And, uh, and that is how you dictate what size to make this and where these hips tie together because as this is on a 45 degree angle you want it to work out so that everything works out equal pitched. So how would you come up with the angle and how do you know what angle that these hips run at? Well that's simple math and if you come over here to the calculator and notice that uh, in, a, in a circle you have 360 degrees. That's simple math and you know with an octagon you have eight sides so what you do is you would divide it by Eight, and that equals 45 so that shows that the walls run at a 45 degree angle from here to here but the hips they actually run and they divide that angle in half because of the way they run so you're going to divide that by two and you end up with 22 and a half so now that we know we know that we have a 22 and a half degree angle that these hips run at and that's exactly what we want these hips to run at here so that everything works out right Okay, so if you'd like to purchase the rest of this video, you're going to need to go to roofframing101.com. So let's type that in, www.roofframing101.com. And you can see this is our site here, and notice that it uh, brings you to our blog page when you get started. And uh, then notice this bar that popped up here. If, uh, if you'd like, you can put your email address in the bar here and get on our subscribers list. You'll, uh, you'll get a free gift if you do that. And then you'll also get notified of uh, new products when they come out and also uh, new blog posts. So you can do that if you'd like. And um, you can see on the, on the blog post here, we've posted a video that we did just a little bit ago on uh, the secret of uh, cutting a roof rafter for a shed roof. So you can watch that if you'd like. Now if you go over here and click on the products tab, that'll take you to our page with, um, as you can see, we have quite a few more products for sale here. And um, notice down here, it's not out yet, it says coming soon, but our roof framing DVD series. That's going to be a complete series of three different videos where we actually build complete roofs um, with octagons and irregular hips and valleys and uh, we're actually going to figure those out in the office but then we're going to take you to the site and we're actually going to cut and assemble those out in the field and show you how to do that so that's going to be a great uh, great series now if uh, you notice number two here it says tutorial e-video on how to frame a bay window roof click here so if you click that link it'll bring you to a new page and uh, you can see here that it's fourteen ninety five and uh, down here you can click the buy now button to purchase it and uh, if you have PayPal you can buy it through your PayPal account or if you don't have PayPal you can still buy it uh, through PayPal just using your credit card by clicking this link so I uh, hope you enjoy this and I hope to have you as a customer thank you